Hello, Cancerians. Welcome back. Welcome to your reading. Sending you guys so much love and light. Let's begin this message. Thank you all for being here. Main female lovers. It's February 15th. Maybe someone's birthday. Someone has emotions for a feminine energy. There's a gift here from this mature man. May 17th. Taurus energy. This person wants to court you. It's great fortune. Marriage. There's bad health within a marriage. Could be some legalities. There's something here changing because it could be a divorce between two people that are married. Who knows? Let's get one more energy. There's a gift here coming to, towards you. High honor. I'm seeing a masculine energy. Official person. This energy is an official person. Give me one more message for Cancer. Someone rising in Venus. There's a gift here coming towards you. Somebody wanting to court you. I'm seeing now courthouse. Taking a journey, traveling this man again. False person pathway. This person could have realized that they were dealing with a false feminine who had someone else in the background. This false feminine has another person. So they're making a pathway. There's a new beginning, unexpected income. This person's traveling. There's something here has ended. Okay, there's a message coming to you. July 11th, maybe your birthday. What is this gift? I'm seeing a queen of swords. So this person's leaving behind an ex. Yeah, two of swords. This gift is coming in from someone you're not speaking to or you, you don't see this coming. A Tiffany lamp may resonate for someone. I'm seeing a Tiffany lamp here. <laughs> that may be the gift that someone has for you. I don't know. King of Pentacles, Seven of Cups, Six of Cups. There's a lot of daydreaming, a lot of daydreaming, reminiscing about the past with you. This earth energy, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person could be going through some legalities at this time. King of Pentacles. Is this who the gift is coming in from? I'm seeing Scorpio death energy. Clarify this gift for Cancer. This person has a gift for you. <clears throat> Two of Wands and they're planning. King of Swords, Seven of Pentacles. Someone who's looking back. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Communicating. This is someone you're not in communications with. You, you may... You may be shocked and surprised by this. Two of Wands with a tower. Someone who's planning something. They could be experiencing an ending right now. Oh, yes. Ten of Swords, Five of Pentacles with a Five of Wands. This energy is turning their back. Aquarius energy turning their back on a situation here. It could be a Leo at a distance also. Something here changing for this energy with a tower. Yeah, Ten of Cups could be something to do with their family. Yeah, it could be something about a commitment or family that's changing. Give me one more energy. Yeah, five of pentacles. This energy feels liberated. See, they're packing their bags and the fool packs up lightly. They're packing their bags and they're leaving this wealthy man from a false energy, a false feminine. Making a pathway. Hmm. This feminine could have been interested in mud, you know, could have been something to something to do with finances. It's not over. I'm seeing this coffin here. Like this person was expecting to receive unexpected income or, or some sort of payout or money. I'm seeing financial lack with this five of pentacles due to some sort of ruling, courthouse ruling. There's a decision here. This could be from a divorce, okay? There's a decision. Um, this gift this gift is coming in from this King of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Who could be waiting? Again, who could be waiting here for a payout? A decision to, meet, to be made by a judge so that they can come forward. This is also about mentally conflicted. There's something here who's meant somebody who you're not speaking to coming forward. With a gift, this person has matured. They consulted with a father figure who's matured. Somebody who's courting here, Cancer. Look, something about a family situation has changed for this person. 
I see someone here feeling left out in the cold or somebody that could be homeless. You know, it's not, it doesn't have to be that drastic. But again, the fives. Five of Pentacles, five of Wands. Who wants to court here, Cancer? Great fortune and high honor is what's coming to you. Oh, yes. The Empress, great fortune, abundance. This could be a Taurus, a Libra. Whoever's, whoever's courting you is distressed, could be about this feminine energy, wanting to court this feminine energy, or there's a feminine energy who's distressed because somebody wants to court you. I see you Cancer as the Empress. I see a person wanting to make things work with you. This person could have been holding back due to a third party. Yeah, due to a third party. I'm seeing 33. Three of Pentacles and the Three of Cups. Might have built a foundation here elsewhere. This is all changing now. What is this courthouse? Yeah, this is all changing. Eight of Cups. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Look, there's a courthouse. There's justice, legalities for this person. Something here, it's happening with them in relations to, it could be karmic. It could be a decision being made by a judge. Sometimes you, the King of Swords, as a judge. However, this is, I feel, who's communicating with you. And again, I don't I don't feel like you see this coming, Cancer, with this Two of Swords. This is someone that may have Earth placements, Leo placements. I'm seeing the Sun. Somebody sees you stable. This is someone that has been hesitant or in between something, something else. Yeah, in between, there's, there, there could have been a choice between lovers or a choice between their family or a commitment, responsibilities. I'm seeing Eight of Pentacles again. Gemini energy. We have Gemini Libra. I feel like this is just making a decision. There's a choice here between lovers wanting to court you, but in distress. Who's in distress? Because you're receiving the victory. Someone's in distress because you're winning. I feel like there's a person that feels like you got away You got away with something. There's high honor and respect. We have it here. High honor. Six of Wands. Gemini. Uh, I was going to say Libra again. Virgo. This is implementing action to create something new. Attraction. I keep looking at this King of Swords. What is this King of Swords? Hermit energy. Page of Wands. There's a message here, communication from this person here. Yeah, there's a message. There is a message. There's a message from this energy. It could be an apology. It could be a message, communication. This is someone that I feel like wants to be alone right now. Someone may propose something long-term to you with this Ten of Pentacles. Yeah. Judgment. We have the tower. Look at this. Look, look at this energy for you, Cancer. Judgment, Six of Cups, and the Tower. This is somebody here from your past resurfacing. I have to say it like I see it. Six of Cups is past life, soulmate, the Tower. It's due to this change that's ho that's going on right now. Mars energy, Six of Cups. This is a message coming in from this person. This person is offering you something long-term. King of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Interesting that I'm seeing the Ten of Cups. There's a proposal here for, for you. Either to move in together or to reconcile. This energy is giving you high honor. Clarify this King of Swords. Give me one more energy for this King of Swords. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Give me one more energy. What is this King of Swords communicating to Cancer? This person has had a lot of time here to reflect, to think. This is, this is communicating with this divine feminine, feeling excited about it. Someone's excited to communicate with you. Clarify this King of Swords. Oh my God. Okay, so I'm seeing Divine Feminine again. Knight of Wands. But see, it's this King of Pentacles that wants to show here with his Four of Pentacles. This person has been holding on to something for a while. Either a gift, something tangible that they've had for you. To give to you. Look at this Knight of Wands showing with the Seven of Swords. There's something about a home dynamic that's changing for this person. 
this is all going to be coming to the light. I feel like that is what's happening with somebody either with his ex, this Queen of Swords. King of Pentacles holding back from you. That is his King of Swords now coming forward. This person could have a Capricorn, Venus, Moon, Eight of Pentacles. I want to work on this. See, they're offering you something long term. This person's this person's seeing it, wanting to court you. This is somebody that sees great fortune with you. This is abundance, wealth. They see it. They see it. That is a King of Swords. Someone who sees, who's logical, sees the path forward. Extremely intelligent. Judgment. Get ready, Cancer. Something here is resurfacing back. See, you're getting away with something. A completion has. It's going to turn in your favor. Some sort of cycle that has completed here. Could be with your stability. Some of you have had to juggle finances. Okay, there's new energy that's coming in with the sun or something could could have been exposed. See, it's like you're getting away with what you've wanted. You're getting away with a wish or something you've wanted, a wish fulfillment. Three of Swords. There's, <laughs> there's somebody here who's not too happy, who's not gonna be too happy. Three of Swords and the Page of Swords could be a third party that could be watching you get this wish fulfillment, something like that. I feel like that is, I think I channeled that message. It could be a divine feminine that is in distress because somebody wants to court you. I feel like there's a king of pentacles here who's coming forward. They're not they're not coming forward empty-handed. They're coming forward with communication. An offering for you. Someone could have been trying to block a connection between you and this person. Yeah, this queen of swords. This queen of swords at a distance. I feel like this person is leaving this this other person, this other third party. They're making a judgment. Someone's making a judgment call to either resolve something to do. I mean, because it's 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 resolving in legalities. I feel like this is actually a person that's waiting for a payout, a payout, waiting for a decision from the court, from the courts. Yeah, for a payout. Ten of Pentacles and the Six of Pentacles. Yeah, a lot of reflection, reflecting. Six of Pentacles. This energy has something to give to you. And it has to it has to do with um, something here secure for your security. I, I don't know why I said for your security. Okay, so they may give you money. Somebody here may have find you know some sort of monetary something that they need to give to you. Gift. There's a gift here for you. Eight of Wands. Travels. Communication. Yeah, for this masculine Aries doesn't have to be an Aries, but this is someone from your past. That is how I see the Five of Cups. So um, let's get. A few energies from this day, Cancer, Divine, Divine Masculine, and Divine Feminine. Two two energies that are, are not speaking to one another. These are two people, Aquarius. There's an attraction, a seg attraction here for you. There's two people that are not in communications with each other. In addition to whether you may not see this come, this is two. This is somebody that has been in a mental conflict for some time. And now there's a sense of breakthrough. It's interesting. I didn't see the Ace of Swords. Give me an energy from this deck. This breakthrough could be this judgment. A judgment could also speak about an awakening. Interesting. We have renew. A return. A return of passion and play. So a community here is healing. Something is healing. Laughter, travel, and new things that can re-spark your love life. We have twin flames, telepathy with this twin flame that could have been battling some sort of pattern. Could be anything, could be with money, could be the material, an addiction. Yeah, masculine energy. That's experiencing a tower or has gone through a tower. Okay, new patterns, something new here, feels new. And we did see the sun a few times. Doing things differently in order to bring health and vitality into your love life this is uh, at a distance this is all happening at a distance we have rejection someone's rejecting somebody due to a red flag there's a situation here yeah somebody received guidance pertaining a situation this person wants to reconcile with you wanting another chance the return of a past soulmate now i don't know who's rejecting here who but somebody here is rejecting a person due to a red flag of some kind. 
tune into the subtle energy that you are receiving about the situation listen to the messages from your body and trust your gut and intuition there there it is rejection we have reconciliation someone wants another chance to make things right between you and them this person has a lot of uh des desire for you pet this past life soulmate i should say this person whom you've had many past lives with um they're desiring you could be a sagittarius something's coming into alignment somebody's demonstrating express the values beliefs that you have learned about love be open to new ways new ways there's something here new okay thought patterns in a lot of reflection a masculine energy who could be in reflection of the past with you give me an energy to complete this reading for cancer let me know if this resonated cancer i love you guys past life soulmates i can't make this up you have known each other before you have known that each other before may perhaps since the two of you were children or young or that or you and this person both have children past life relationship you have known each other before something new is happening being renewed for you with this person i see somebody here coming back with an again i, I don't want to keep repeating myself but the, there it is the page of cups i'm seeing here reconciliation and children again actually this card came out of the deck i believe someone from your past is returning to your to your life okay it is safe for you to love open your heart and, and receive the highest energy of all see we saw that four of pentacles with the king of pentacles holding this is somebody that has been holding back or suppressing <laughs> i almost whistled or suppressing emotions for you give me one more energy for cancer there's a reconciliation here somebody has a gift for you retreat it's time to disconnect from the world so keeping an open mind your soulmate may be different than your usual type it is safe for you to love again it is safe for you to love open up your heart romantic feelings this is someone that has romantic feelings calling you in i don't know if i channel that message of telepathy so cancer i'm going to leave the reading here now actually hold on i always do that i don't know why give me one more energy for cancer okay seeing victory in some endeavor but it's showing reverse the letter v may resonate for you it's interesting because victory is reversed but then we have good fortune okay good fortune for you so something here might have some someone might have not had victory here with something else okay you're on the road to success for somebody here wanting to overcome this mountain <laughs> this mountain between you and them good fortune victory is reversed so give me one more okay we have vacation you may take a vacation give me one more energy you're on the road to success Something here has failed for someone else. Need one more energy, okay? Yeah, a wish is granted. A wish is granted. This misunderstanding. See, I channel this wall or mountain. This is somebody that wants to overcome a mountain. You will, you will overcome a mountain, or potentially even a struggle or some sort of obstacle that's misunderstanding that somebody wants to resolve with you. I'm seeing family matters. Family matters for someone. A wish is granted a new home new attitude heartache over what you no longer have in a two-faced friend there's a two-faced friends that's disappointed three of swords i feel like somebody here has to move new home new attitude or somebody doesn't want to move doesn't want to change their attitude they're heartbroken because of friends that could have been two-faced friends there's heartache, okay, of what you no longer have. That makes sense why victory here is reversed. Somebody needs to change their attitude or their home. That is what I have for you, Cancer. Let me know if this resonated. I love you guys. I'll be back soon with another message. Leave a comment if you're interested in winning the free deck giveaway. I'll be announcing the winners on the 1st, 11, 01, and 11, 11. Thank you so much. I love you guys. I'll be back soon. Until next reading, namaste.